Greetings, dear souls. I'm Archangel Michael, and I'm here to tell you more about the reality you live in. Humanity must be made aware of all the concealed knowledge, as it is necessary for everyone to know what has been withheld from the public for a long time. Every day, more and more bad activities come to light. The corrupted spirits are attempting to act as though nothing unusual is happening and that their schemes are succeeding, but their plans fall short on a regular, if not hourly, basis. Strong high frequencies are being used by the Divine, the Ascended Masters, and the Galactic Light Forces to dismantle the 3D Matrix. Before we can completely make the shift to a new 5D Earth, something needs to occur. It is up to each of you to accept whatever comes your way, good or bad. It's a necessary component of the path your soul has chosen. Take a look at the Olympic Games in Paris, where wickedness was blatantly displayed at the opening ceremony, which exploited the Last Supper as a symbol to attack human religion. You and your life are unimportant to the henchmen who work for their bosses. All they have on their minds is carrying out their plan to exterminate humanity. My dear souls, some of you give them too much credit. Their technologies are not as advanced as they would have you think. Had they been, mankind would have vanished from the face of the planet long ago. Everything they produce is flawed in some manner. They are being watched over by the Ashtar Command to make sure they don't do something stupid that may put the lives of all people in jeopardy. I would also want to tell you of another crucial piece of information. At this time, all gates surrounding your planet are closed. There won't be any openings for them anytime soon. That is incorrect information. There won't be any 888 Lion's Gate energy entering through a portal. Starships typically employ portals to move fast and across large distances in space. Energy does not pass through them. The galactic light forces clarified this. The light forces are at work to stop any uninvited guests from the cosmos from escalating the unrest on Mother Earth. There are enough problems on Earth today. You don't need another originating from space. In northwest Wyoming, the United States, near the Biscuit Basin of Yellowstone National Park, an occurrence that was characterized as a hydrothermal explosion took place. This was the result of water in the shallow hydrothermal system beneath the Black Diamond Pool abruptly turning to steam. A neighboring boardwalk was destroyed and grapefruit-sized pebbles were thrown tens to hundreds of feet away as the explosion propelled steam and debris hundreds of feet into the air. The bricks that were closest to the explosion location weighted hundreds of pounds and measured roughly three feet broad. The greatest debris blocks fell in the direction of the Firehole River, which was the primary target of the explosion. Mud and debris mixed with the steam and boiling water to give the explosion its black color. What then actually transpired that day? The Ashtar Command destroyed a Dracos base that was underground. The hydrothermal eruption was set off by explosions that occurred deep within the base. X the operation was a success. Ashtar destroyed the base using cloaked shuttles. Not every Draco you encounter is hostile toward people or other advanced societies, but this specific gang was collaborating with the planet's dark entities. There is still a lot going on in your world at the moment. Have patience. This too shall pass. I am grateful, Ambassador of the Light Forces of the Galaxy. Please accept my deepest love and blessings. I'm here for you at all times.